Hey guys, good morning. It's Thomas Southern Outdoors Fishing. I know, I know, it's been a while. It's November 5th, 2018. Going fishing this morning. Going down to a uh, place that I usually go to to catch catfish, bass, uh, white, white perch, crappy, you name it. I'm kind of going after all of it. So uh, hopefully we'll, we'll get into some of that. Um, the crappy bite is good right now. The blue cat bite is good right now. So I brought the crappy rod and I brought a catfish rod along with my bass stuff. So we had quite a bit of rain last night. Um, not sure exactly how much. Hope it won't affect it too much. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be on the Yakima River chain, close to where the Yard River comes to Lake Tillery. I'll be on Lake Tillery. The moon phase shows the fishing to be really good today. Um, so that's kind of one of my influences going, going this morning. The other influences, I'm off today. So I'm going, I've got the morning to myself. Well, what I'll probably do is bass fish for a little bit. Blue cat bite is pretty hot right now. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, hopefully we can, hopefully we can definitely get in on some of that. And the rain looks like it's moving out, so we should be good to go. Call bite should be for the bass should be pretty good right now. I ain't even been I hadn't even been bass fishing in wow, while wow. <laughs> a while. So I'm gonna try some top water. I'm gonna try some uh, just different things. See what I can see what I, what I can do to catch a bass with. If the bass ain't biting. I'm going I'm going catfishing. So uh, I know I can catch a, should be able to catch a cat. Probably won't go all the way up to the dam. Um, probably stay behind the, the rocks, more than likely. You really need two people to go up there with you just in case, just in case something happens. You just never really know. So it's kind of, you know, if you're gonna go, if you're gonna go to a kind of iffy place, just bring somebody along. You just, you just never know. But in any case, we're gonna go up here and we'll have fun. All right, guys, stay tuned. Look at the deer. Can you see them? They're just cruising across the road. Ain't worried about nothing. Holy crap, what in the heck is going on with the Wow, what in the world? The 
be no fishing done today, I can tell you that. Goodness, what in the world are they doing? I don't know what in the crap they're doing. Well guys, as you can see, there is no water. Um, it's blocked off. A uh, gentleman just pulled up and told me uh, they're supposed to be dropping it down eight foot to let uh, to for customers built that's you know got houses and everything on the on the uh, lake river you know allow them to rebuild any sea walls or build decks fix decks or whatever they do it every eight years they they said so I think I'm just gonna go back to the house I guess and just. You know, we'll try it another day, another place. Because it'll take me an hour to get back home, which was a waste of time coming down here, but I didn't know anything about it. So, it's pretty depressing, to be honest with you. But I ain't got time really to go nowhere else. It's too far to drive. Hi guys, so we're going to make the best of our morning. I'm a little bummed out right now because uh, we didn't, wasn't able to go down to where I wanted to go fishing at, down at the lake because they drove, they pulled, the, they've got the water so far pulled down, you just, you can't really get out there. So anyway, we're going, like I said, we're going to make the best of it. We're going to go down here to the pond. We're going to fish around a little bit and see if we can't make something happen. Stay tuned guys. I know this has kind of been an odd video, but you know, things happen. So maybe it was for the best, and uh, we're going to go out here, and, like I said, and try to make the most of our morning. Stay tuned. Be guy. Another little small one, but hey. Still fun. I'm using this little uh, swim bait that I got from uh, Pond Hopper Nation. They're exclusively, exclusively <laughs> Pond Hopper Nation swim baits. Uh, I don't, I don't remember the price of them. They're less than five bucks, I think. For this size this is like the three and a half three or three and a half inch but pond fishing they love them caught a bunch down here a while back on this thing
Ooh, that's a, that's a better one. That's a better fish. Oh yeah. I hope we don't throw it. I hope we don't throw it. That's a good fish. That's a good fish. Right in the corner of the mouth. Hmm. <coughs> oh yeah. <laughs> what? Mm. It's probably it hit that rascal as soon as it hit the water. That's pretty good bass right there now. Mouth closed, tail pinched. He's right at 17 inches. Which ain't bad. Yeah, guys, I hadn't really talked about this reel too much, but I am loving, 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 loving this reel. This is the uh, Cast King Value Eagle. This is the 3000 series. I've got uh, 20 pound Cast Pro on it, and uh, it just performs great. I mean, just great. Hey guys, I've switched to just about 100% Cast Pro. Love this stuff. It casts good. It uh, is super abrasive when fishing salt water around oyster rocks and docks and things like that for uh, for drum and all that stuff. They, it's just ah, one cup and hit it. But uh, it's super, super abrasive and some of the strongest line I've ever had. There's one. Didn't even know I had it. Kind of small guy. He was just kind of sitting there with it. I feel like I, I had one, but wasn't really sure. Little bitty guy. guy right here he didn't want to talk I just reeling up through that brush over there this little guy hit it on top nice oh, that's another good one that's a good one he eh, might took it a little deep though I don't know I can't tell you chance that one I just let that rest out there you go guys that's not a bad little fish
Fish you all on that there, buddy. Caught that little guy on a loopless crank. All right, guys. So I did pretty good out here on the water. Um, I seen the FedEx guy come up, and I thought, well, I better get on up there because I ordered something um, for my business that I had to. I was kind of wondering if I needed to sign for it, and I did. So it comes FedEx. Can't really say what it is yet, but I'm excited. It's going to help out on my videography for my business. Cletus. He heard me down here and he got to work. <laughs> that other pond raced up here and got up there just in time. He's getting ready to fix it. He's fixing to leave, so. I ran up, ran up there and, and was able to sign for the package, but uh, I'll show this uh, in the near future, and you'll definitely be seeing it in my videography and my uh, videos, my production videos. Yeah, I'm excited. All right, guys, take care, and uh, we caught a few fish today. It was a good day. Um, it's been a crazy morning, crazy morning. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next video, and uh, y'all take care.